Hey Cancer, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a quick love reading for the sign of Cancer. So if you're a Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, or if you have a stellium in Cancer, this reading is going to be for you. Keep in mind, this is going to be a general reading, so it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, let it fly. Don't try to force the message. Also, don't let this reading take anything from you. And lastly, do consider subscribing to my channel. That which will help me to tap into your energy for future readings. We begin your reading with the Two of Cups. The King of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles also tried coming out. But these were too many cards so I didn't take them. Okay. They really want to come towards you. Almost come running towards you. The Knight of Wands is a very passionate kind of energy, fiery kind of energy. So this is the kind of person who feels a lot of love for you. But at the same time, they're very mature. They want to be very stable. They want to come off as this King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is a very mature, stable energy. You build a future with the uh, King of Pentacles. You build the Ten of Pentacles with the King and Queen of Pentacles. So this person probably already sees you as this queen of pentacles. They see you as someone with whom they can build a future. And that is why they want to come off as someone who is very stable, who has their stuff together, who, who is very like, mature enough to have a, be in a relationship with. That is how this person wants to come off. Now, it is very possible that re in reality, this is the Knight of Wands kind of person. So this is a very immature, in and out kind of person who is trying to be mature, who is trying to come up as this King of Pentacles. This also could be someone, uh, a person who is trying to level up in their life. They are trying to go from this Knight of Wands towards this, to this King of Pentacles kind of energy. The reason being, they are in love with you. And that is why they feel like for love, they want to level up in life. Yeah, see, as I said, for love, they want to level up in life. And that is why they are trying really, really hard to work on themselves. This is also a kind of person I feel like who's very, very focused right now on their pentacles, on their money, who is trying to work on themselves. They're trying to perfect a skill. They could also be trying to have their own business. This person might have a lot of ideas in, and they are trying to bring them into fruition. They are trying to bring them into reality. But the King of Cups, this, this person feels a lot. The King of Cups, the Two of Cups, they have a lot of love for you. Okay. Alright, let's clarify now. They are trying to be analytical. They are trying to listen to their intuition. They are trying to think, what do I need to do to make this connection work? What do I need to do to be in this King of Pentacles energy? Yeah, they are stalking you, all right. Knight of Swords, Page of Swords. Yeah, I definitely get this is a very immature energy who is trying to level up, who is trying to be mature, who is trying to be at par with you. And that is why they are working on themselves. In the past, this person could definitely have been in this Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands energy. They did whatever they felt like. Their words didn't match their actions. And you were very, I definitely get this feeling that you were very, very disappointed with this person about how they came off, about how their words never matched their actions and how they were in and out of your life. So there was very, there was a lot of instability between the both of you. And now this person absolutely hates it and they want to change it. They want to change. They want to change for you. They want to be this king of pentacles energy for you. And that is why they are trying to be as logical as possible and trying to work on themselves, trying to come up with plans that will help them be in this king of pentacles energy. Yeah, see the ace of wands and ace of swords. They want a new beginning. They want to have a stability with you. And bottom of the deck, in this deck is the higher of hand, which talks about commitment. They want commitment. And we have a match here. The Queen of Swords. The King of Swords. Let's 
get one more card. One more card, sorry. Yeah, see, this, this is what I said. You are, they are trying to level up to you. They see you as someone who gets a lot of attention, who is doing well in your, in your life. You are really doing well in your life. You have a lot of options. People are recognizing you. It could be in your workplace. It could be something you are doing in your life that is making people recognize you. You could be in the spotlight for a lot of you. You could be, um, you, you know, have a social media presence. And that is why this person, the page of swords, as I said, this person is talking you. So because you are getting a lot of attention on social media and everything, this person is very, very aware that you are getting a lot of attention. You also could be very good looking. So that is why you have a lot of uh, options going on. This is how this person sees you. The King of Swords here, they see you as someone who is um, very cold and detached right now. And this is because, as I said, they were in this Knight of Swords, the Knight of Wands energy. So you were very disappointed in how this person was walking, how this person's words and uh, actions did not match. You were very, very disappointed with this person. And that is why you are being in this King of Swords energy. The King of Swords is very, very cold and detached. The King of Swords is also a very masculine energy. So they see you right now being in this masculine energy. You are not in this feminine energy. The feminine energy is much more giving and caring and nurturing. But they are right now seeing you as this masculine energy. Okay, let's clarify. to see you as this empress kind of energy the hermit the empress yeah you have a lot on your plate right now You have a lot on your plate you're focused on you have a lot of things going on in your life that is how this person is seeing you so things are working out you might have multiple projects going on uh, in your life multiple things are working out the empress is the kind of energy who gives birth right so they see you as someone who's very very you are giving birth to new projects you are giving birth to new ideas also all the time the page of wands so a lot of ideas you do have a lot of ideas and you give birth to those ideas they see you as someone who has an idea and they make it work no matter what idea you have you will make it work you will make money out of it almost so they see you as like they have put you up on a pedestal definitely with the hermit here again that silence that no contact situation is going on with the king of swords the hermit this person sees you as someone who has detached themselves uh, completely and the reason behind that is because you want to get some clarity you want to understand about this connection and you are not willing to give to the connection that is not serving you it is also very possible that because you went silent this person decided to focus on themselves and this person realized that they need to get their game together because if they don't you are going to reject them there isn't going to be a chance between the both of you. You could be dealing with a Virgo or a Libra or a Taurus. was at the bottom of the deck you could be dealing with the Taurus here this person wants commitment but they know that um, they have to 
first work on themselves they know that you are looking for clarity you are looking for the truth from this person you are looking for someone who is going to follow through their words not someone who says something and does something else they realize that is what you are looking for and they know that that is what they have to bring towards you but if you are looking for some clarity from this person soon it is going to take some time also this person i feel like um, they are very emotionally this is not the kind of person who is very expressive the king of cups can be a very non expressive kind of an energy so this person is learning to express themselves they are learning to almost level up the hierophant can also talk about leveling up so this person is learning all of that it is going to take some time for this person to bring the truth to bring the clarity towards you because they the ace of swords came out in reverse this person probably will lie to you a lot could be dealing with a taurus here five of swords it came out in reverse the sun As I said, this is going to be a very slow person. They are going to come in very, very slowly. The Knight of Pentacles is a slow energy, but the Knight of Pentacles is a very loyal energy. Whatever mind games, as I said, this person could have lied to you a lot in the past. Whatever mind games, whatever lying, cheating, whatever there was in the past, this person knows that they have to come out of that energy if they want to be with you. And for that, they have to move slowly. They can't rush into this connection again. Also, this five five. The Hierophant is five, and this is the five of swords. So five five. This person is going through a lot of changes. It is going to take some time for this person to reintegrate all of those changes. And the Hierophant, as I said, it could be leveling up. This person also could be, you know, consulting people, uh, like people or friends or anyone they think highly of. This person is trying to consult them to see how they can change themselves, how they can make themselves better. So this is the kind of person who is very focused right now on bettering themselves up so that they can be a match with you. Because they think very highly of you and they are in love with you. They have a lot of love for you. The king of cups, the two of cups, the king of pentacles. They want to be the king of pentacles. Although they see you as this empress and there is no emperor here but... They want to be this king of pentacles energy to match your energy. And then they want to come towards you. So this is going to be a very, very slow process. This could be the kind of connection where they are getting inspired by you. You inspire them. You inspire them to change themselves. All right, Cancer. You could be dealing with a Leo here, if I didn't already mention that. But that's your reading. I hope you find the clarity you've been looking for. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, take care guys. Bye-bye.